Hi guys, welcome to Neat SS Super Learning Bytes. So today the topic I would like to discuss is the concept of interpreting ascitic fluid. Initial days, transudate and exudate concept was being used, but off late, the concept of SAG and the protein levels are being used. Now, SAG if more than 1.1 is called high SAG and if less than 1.1 is called low SAG and proteins more than 2.5 is considered significant or high and less than 2.5 is considered low. So, there are four combinations which can occur. One is high SAG high protein ascites. Now, high SAG high protein ascites, we should be thinking about butt carry syndrome and right heart failure as the causes. The second type is high SAG low protein ascites. Now, high SAG low protein ascites is generally because of portal hypertension, most likely secondary to cirrhosis. The third condition which can occur is low SAG high protein ascites. Now, these conditions are basically peritoneal causes like peritoneal carcinomas or it could be peritoneal tuberculosis. The last type which can occur is low SAG low protein ascites which can be seen in protein losing conditions like nephrotic syndrome or protein losing enteropathy. So, now we know the four combinations or different types of ascites based on SAG and proteins and at least two causes for each of them. So, for more such updates stay tuned to social media app of Doctorials. Thank you.